<clears throat> we are reading Be Still, Nine Day Devotional for the Hopeful Heart by Kaleri Cherry. We'll be reading First John chapter 3, verse 19, In the Hands of Hope. This is how we know that we belong to the truth and how we set our hearts at rest in his presence. First John 3, 19. We try so hard to make things happen on our own, don't we? In our timing, the way we like it, how we're playing it in our mind, and our mixing up of roles, we often forget his power. We think we have to wake him up to our reality, to our reality. when the waves feel too big and inform him of our dreams when the water seems what baby stagnant stagnant yes stagnant but he is God he knows our desires and where we would like to go he knows our shortcomings and what might prevent us from getting there he knows our potential and the possibility that lies within us he also knows the timing of how it comes together how things will shift into place how certain doors will close and unexpected ones will open how stubborn we can get when we believe in something and how fearful we allow our hearts to get when variability calls our name yet when yet even though he knows all he gives us Place when we think we do. It's like a child pretending to drive a car while sitting in a parent's lap, gripping the steering wheel, wide-eyed and ready, believing they're in control when in reality the little parent has control of the wheel the entire time. Sorry about the noise, baby. <clears throat> the child's feet dangle in midair as the parent presses the gas and the brake. They chuckle at that their child believes the verbal command go faster as he makes the car go at high speeds. Higher speeds. Isn't this us white knocking the wheel, believing we are in control, while our father smiles and keeps us on course? We do not have to worry that our God is one who doesn't know what we want or need or that he's going to send you or still and won't provide it. Or even that his timeline is a little behind in behind what our mind tells us is the socially acceptable timeline. Our desires are not far from his mind. He is mighty. Trust what he knows and follow where he goes. Remember his hands, they have us. And haven't we learned his hands do not fail? Prayer. Dear Jesus, thank you for being patient in our stubbornness and forgetfulness. Remind our heart that your will is perfect and true. You know us in intricately. 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 I can't pronounce it's, it. It's okay, baby. And you lead us perfectly. We place today in your hands. In Jesus' name, amen. Tomorrow, we will be reading Removing the Busy Badge. Yes. So, see y'all tomorrow. I like